Let's take a look at the molecular geometry and the bond angles for TeCl4. This is tellurium tetrachloride. So the first thing we do when we're looking at these molecular geometries, we need to have a Lewis structure. This is our Lewis structure. If you need help with this, there's a link at the end of this video. Do note that the central tellurium atom has one, two, three, four, five pairs of electrons. So it has 10 valence electrons. That's okay though, it can have an expanded octet. So the way we do this, we're gonna look at the steric number. That's the number of things attached to that central atom. We have one, two, three, four chlorines, and one lone pair. So we have five things attached to the central atom. We're gonna need a new chart. That's better. So our steric number is five because there are five things attached to the central atom, and we have that one lone pair right here. So one lone pair, steric number of five, this gives us what we call a seesaw molecular geometry. Let's look at that in three dimensions. So the central atom here, that's the TE, the tellurium. We have four chlorine atoms. Let's put them around one, two, three. They're spreading out four, and they spread out to be as far away as they can from each other. That gives us a tetrahedral molecular geometry. But remember that lone pair, that occupies space. And when we put that here, it pushes everything down. We end up with what's called a seesaw molecular geometry for TeCl4. Let's go back to our Lewis structure. So we have our seesaw molecular geometry for TeCl4. We could also use the AXE notation to figure out the molecular geometry. Let's do that up here. A, that's the central atom, that's the Te. X, that's the number of chlorine atoms, one, two, three, four. E, that's the number of lone pairs. We have one. So for AX4E1, if you look that up on a table of molecular geometries, that's going to be seesaw, just like we found before. If you wanted to look at the bond angles here, these bond angles here or here or here would be 90 degrees. This is Dr. B with the molecular geometry for TeCl4. Thanks for watching.